come and see. Learning's fun on Cradle Kids. Come and watch. Come and see. Learning's fun on Cradle Kids TV. Cradle Kids TV. Hello, and this is Cradle Kids TV, where learning is fun. And today we'll be reading the three little pigs. On the edge of a beautiful forest live a mummy pig, a daddy pig, and three little pigs. The time had come for the three little pigs to leave home. Watch out for the big bad wolf, warned the daddy pig as he waved goodbye. The three little pigs hadn't walked very far when the first little pig grew tired. Oh, this will do, yawned the lazy little pig. He found some straw nearby and quickly built his house. It wasn't long before the second little pig stopped walking and looked around her. This will do, she said, and swiftly built her house from sticks and branches that were scattered around her. The third little pig walked on and on and on. Finally, he found a pretty field by a flowing stream. It was a perfect place to build his house. The third little pig decided to build a strong brick house to keep him safe from the wolf. He drew plans. He bought the best bricks he could find. He could find. And finally, after weeks of hard work, he stood by, back and admired his beautiful new home. Meanwhile, the hungry big bad wolf came across the first little pig and his house of straw. Little pig, little pig, let me come in, said the big bad wolf. Not by the hair on my chinny chin chin, cried the first little pig. Then I'll huff, then I'll puff, then I'll blow your house down, howled the angry wolf. So the big bad wolf huffed and he puffed and the tiny straw house came tumbling down. The little pig ran as fast as he could until he arrived at the house made of sticks. The big bad wolf snuck up to the house. Little pigs, little pigs, let me come in, he growled. <coughs> Not by the hairs on our chinny chin chins, cried the frightened little pigs. Then I'll huff and I'll puff and I'll blow your house down, howled the angry wolf. So the big bad wolf huffed and he puffed and the wobbly stick house came tumbling down. The two little pigs ran on and on and on until they finally reached the third little pig's house. Don't worry, we are safe in my strong brick house, said the third little pig. They heard a bang on the door. Little pigs, little pigs, let me come in, said a familiar voice. It was the wolf. Not by the hairs on our chinny chin chins, cried the three little pigs. Then I'll huff and I'll puff and I'll blow your house down, howled the, howled the angry wolf. So the big bad wolf huffed and he puffed and he puffed and he huffed. But nothing happened. The house didn't even wobble. The wolf was furious and very hungry. He climbed up to the wolf and jumped down the chimney. Splash! Oh! The wolf fell in a pot of boiling hot soup and burned his long furry tail on, on the fire. 
he leapt out of the chimney, off of the chimney, and ran away as quickly as he could. As for the little pigs, they lived happily ever after, made in their house of bricks. They never ever saw the big bad wolf again. Well, that's the end of the story. I hope you liked it. And now it's time for you to go to bed. Good night! Cradle Kids TV.